Today I wanted to talk to you about a very unique piano. This piano that you're seeing right now is from 1937 and it's a Baldwin. And in these days, Baldwin simply called their nine footers D's. The serial number on this piano is 81507. But what makes this piano even more special is the, is the second serial number called 126. And this serial number indicates that the piano was a CNA piano. Now, in case you don't know what a CNA piano is, CNA stands for Concert and Artist, and this means that a CNA piano is one of the best pianos that a company has to offer. And this is a piano that is offered and available for this company's artists to play on when they have a performance. But unlike some CNA pianos, this piano had an easier life than most. Little is known about its history, but what is known is that it spent a lot of its time in a church. No one really knows for sure how many years it spent in this church, but what is known is that it predates all of the members. Another thing that's special about this piano is that a lot of it is original. That harp has never been painted. The paint that you see on the outside of the piano is the original finish. And the soundboard is also original, and it actually has a pressure ridge, which is one of the reasons that this piano is as powerful as it is. Although pressure ridges are often considered controversial, they are also considered beneficial for many pianos, as the pianos with pressure ridges are often the most powerful pianos that you can find, and this piano supports that theory. I will be talking more about pressure ridges in an upcoming episode on soundboards, and I will be including pictures of pressure ridges from this piano. There are some things that have been replaced. It has had new strings, it has had new tuning pins, new hammers, and the pin block was also replaced, and the action has been regulated. But other than that, it is all original, and it is a fantastic piano. I hope you enjoyed my review of this fine, rare piano. If you enjoyed it, make sure to give this video a like, and you can also feel free to check out some of my other content. And if you like that, you might want to think about subscribing. Thank you very much, and I'll see you later.